How did this one captain lead so many men? He had their loyalty, so they followed. And then they all died. He must have been a bad leader. Why do you think that? Well, he led all these men to their deaths. True. But these men chose to follow. Hmm. Even good leaders make poor choices. The best take responsibility for them. Remember this. Tears, braziers. A symbol of the light that binds all realms together. Why would he use those strange runes, though? Now you mention it, he wouldn't. Huh. Huh. That's interesting. Father, were you ever a leader? I... many years ago, yes. I led men in battle. Were you a good leader? It is... complicated. Did you... No ever... more questions, boy. Focus on the task at hand. Yes, sir. Question. If Ymir was the first giant, where did he come from? In the beginning, there was Ganungagop, the great void. There were no realms yet, only primordial forces. There was fire, and there was ice. And there in the void, they met and produced... Water? More than water. The mystic lifeblood of something entirely new. From this water, Ymir formed and became a being of pure creation and chaos, mother and father to all that came after. Even the Aesir? Aye. Every god, man and beast came first from Amir's flesh. Though it was the Aesir that thought themselves so superior that they should hold dominion over the rest of creation. And we'll pick this up later. <laughs> No, I call it the biggest city. <laughs> it's like a liberation. No, I call it the big. It's like genocide since. I'd like to remind you. Do you know how many babies are. Five day. Four hundred and sixty. That's more than the amazing. Four. I'd like you to. More than that. No, I call it the biggest. Like, like it. Do you know? Bitch, we're not gonna make life. Great! Liberation! Woo! Yes! The, 
shrinking now. That's shrinking, that's scary. That should scare them because they're. It, it doesn't scare them anymore. Do, do, do you see her? That because the. I don't know what I'm Because the. All right, let's say we finish that story. Into the legend of Ymir, the first giant, enter the Aesir gods. It was Odin who took arms against his creator and spilled Ymir's lifeblood with his spear. A necessary evil, he would say, to bring order to the realms. From Ymir's torn flesh, Odin would fashion the realm of Midgard for his own. Called himself All Father as if he was the creator and not the creator's destroyer. The small, covetous tyrant. In here? Huh? Oh, sorry, my boy. Uh, you know, I think at best we just end it there, actually. Captain will be satisfied now. Unlikely. He was determined to put these men to rest himself. But he would have never been able to. That does not matter to him. Our victory will only remind him of his failure. Then why do we do this? <laughs>